Hey everybody, Ricky and Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Race Course in Granville, Pennsylvania on Wednesday, June the 21st. This is Handicap for a day at the track.com and the Equibase Winter Circle. Let's take a look at race 7 tonight, folks. 8.43 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mild test on the dirt track. We have fillies and mares, 3 years old and up, racing for a prize of some... $34,400. Contenders number five. Here's a reminder. Number four, Ransom Pass Due. Number three, Spring Away. And number one, Forest Due. Number five, here's a reminder, is hit the board in Power Run fashion in four of the last five outings, putting a trio of Power Run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jocka Dana Whitney and trainer Tim Kreiser centered at the post tonight. They've hit the board with 53% of their entry saddled as a team to date. Number four, Ransom Pass Due, has hit the board at three of her last four, including a power run win in her fourth race back. Race seven summary number five. Here's a reminder. Tops of contenders list tonight here at Penn Nat, which also includes number four, Ransom Pass Due. Number three, Spring Away, and number one, Forest Dew. That's 5431 in the seventh from Penn National. Wednesday, Long Shots, Finger Lakes, race two, the four to one shot. Number seven, Dancing Lion, takes the two level Trackmaster class drop. The overall speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about today's distance of five and one half furlongs on the dirt. Indiana Downs, race six, here in the Philly version. Of the $100,000 Who's Your Breeder Sophomore Stakes, the 6 to 1 shot. Number 8, Roman Dance, has hit the board in Power Run fashion in four of her last five, including a trio of Power Run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. So, from Penn National on a Wednesday night, Rick Needham for DayAtTheTrack.com in the Equibase Winter Circle, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.